Okay, um, right now I'm gonna show you how to um, how to um, install an ISO file onto a virtual computer or virtual box. So in the description, I'm go um, there's a, f a website um, which is the Ubuntu website um, to download the ISO file I'm gonna use. Um, you can use any ISO um, ISO file that you want. So uh, I'm just gonna download it and I already downloaded it once so I'm not going to download it again um, another thing you need is VirtualBox by Sun uh, downloads and then download the file for your correct OS then um, after you've installed it um, open it up and uh, click new then uh, name it what you're going to uh, want the um, OS name to be. I'm going to name it uh, Linux Test because Ubuntu is a form of Linux. And then uh, make sure um, you select the correct operating system. Uh, select your memory size. I'm just going to leave it 512 megabytes. Uh, create new hard disk and it's going to up it open the create new virtual disk wizard next uh, I'm going to lower it down to uh, I'm going to lower it down to one gig because I don't want it to take up too much space because I'm not going to use it very often finish and then finish so now you're going to have uh, the virtual computer right here open it up and it will give you an error message. Just wait. And there's the error message. Now go to uh, CD-DVD devices and click choose a virtual um, CD-DVD disk file. Um, I downloaded it to the downloads folder. So I'm going to go over here and double click the uh, ISO image. Um, your di actual disk... Uh, thing will pop out if you're on a laptop and just insert it back in and close the window power off the machine then turn it back on so this is going to be like a reboot and it should work and now Ubuntu is starting Now um, Ubuntu is running now, and that's it. Bye.